Hey guys, Chris collects things back again. And in today's video, we will be opening this lovely, lovely Rebel Clash booster box. Now, I know Rebel Clash has a bad reputation, I will say. But, I mean, I was able to snag this fairly cheaply before uh, prices for uh, a lot of booster boxes or Pokemon cards in general really shot up through the roof. So... I figured why not at the time. Um, I've opened a few packs from this set, but not a booster box. Um, I've actually already pulled, I'm just looking at my list right now. I've actually already pulled the Rainbow Rare Sonya before, and I've actually pulled a gold card, a number 209 Twin Energy. So thanks, I'm looking at Pokelector. Poke that's with a P-O-K-E-L-L-E-C-T-O-R dot com. That's where I like to keep track of all my cards. I am not, um, <laughs> I am not, uh, sponsoring them, but it's just my go-to website for online, uh, uh, keeping up a checklist of cards. So I highly recommend it. Very good site. Um, so yeah, let's. Let's see if we can pull any more Rainbow Rares or any of these Full Arts. I'm just looking now, like, they all look pretty cool. Bosses Orders, like, Full Rare, Full Art Rare, or even Rainbow Rare is definitely one I'm looking for. Um, I also really like that uh, Rylaboom VMAX, number 193. But I'm not going to be picky here, even the standard Full Arts. I actually already have the Eldegoss V and the Rylaboom V uh, Full Arts as well. So I've actually had pretty good... Uh, success with the set so I'm hoping for some uh, positive pulls here so anyways without further ado um, let's get into it let's get into it all right I don't remember where I got this from it was probably one of the many sites I uh Heard of from Pokemon TCG, uh, the Reddit, or the Discord I'm a part of. Um, definitely didn't get it from one of the big box stores like your Targets or your Walmarts. Usually I get my ETBs from there or my uh, or like individual things. So this this video will probably be in a couple parts because it's like it is a mass a massive amount of packs that you're opening here. 36 packs is, a, is quite the slog, especially for me, uh, especially for the viewers out there. So, all right, here's the packs. As always, I'm going to organize them. We got the Rylaboom, uh, Toxtricity, I always forget your name, and the Bun. So yeah, it's the three starters in Toxtricity, basically, with the, the final forms from Sword and Shield. Let's organize these packs. Are these actually like organized like one, two, three, four? No. I was gonna like, that's quite the coincidence, if it is. So maybe what I will do, since it's gonna be a two-part video, I'm going to open the left half first. And then we will get into the other half in our next video. So it looks pretty even distribution, which I like. There's just one extra uh, bun and one extra Ryla. But I like when things are symmetrical like that. I'm very OCD. Um, so let's get into it. Let's go with the bun. Let's open this pack. I have a bunch of Rebel Clash my uh, binder so no need to be gentle with these i'll still save them because i'm crazy like that and again white code card green code card still is at play here we have a green so starting off not very good but that's okay one two three four cards water energy it's leaf Let me get this centered kevin durant electrodes tools hatna carp Medit, Stunk, Grubbin, Grubhub, a nice reverse holo Voltorb common, and a 
Rare non-hollow toxicity. That card looks pretty cool, even for a non-hollow. So I will take that, we'll put them to the side, the color cards to the side. We actually have our ETB sleeves that we'll be using to uh, sleeve any uh, hollows or rare cards we get. Hopefully we'll get a bunch. So let's go to Ryla Boom next. Dig right in. Um, trying to think of stuff that I wanted to talk about in this video. Uh, just like the state of Pokemon cards in general, like it's been, I know me, it's like, I feel like me, like everyone else with the pandemic, you're a little more bored. So you're just like, you're buying more. And like, I know I have to uh, cut back on that and respect my budget and my wallet a little more. Another green code card, unfortunately. But even then, like I have, like I have some pre-orders for some Shining Fates. I know through Amazon, and I had through Game Nerds, and I still haven't heard squat about them. So like I don't know if they're coming or not. So I'm I'm kind of a little worried there. I think it's Fire Energy. It's Grass again. Uh, Lampent. See, I'm a little worried about my pre-orders actually being fulfilled. I'm hoping like if. It, slow like i don't know if the so the shining fates they had the mini tins on game nerds haven't heard about those so i don't know if there's they got less i'm not sure when i uh there's a nice reverse hollow a cursed shovel and a non hollow a barrascuda <laughs> see i don't know if uh i'm gonna get them like later because maybe i was pre-ordering uh not the first wave and they got uh less of an allocation than they expected I don't know the Rila Boom set. I'm not sure what's up with that. Or it's just like the supply in, in general. Everybody thought they were going to get more and then they just didn't. So, I mean, I just hope it's fulfilled. Because I, I pre-ordered it like a while ago. I don't know if it was like January or December. whenever they opened. Like, I ticked my sights. I got my stuff from Safari Zone. I would, another green code card. So, we're, we're in quite the rut right now. I got my pre-orders from Safari Zone. I got the Pikachu box, like no problem. And what else did I get? An ETB I actually got from Pokemon Center. I don't know how at this point because lately I've just been getting called a bot by Pokemon Center and I can't push anything through because the real bots are just swiping everything. And like, I'm refusing to pay scalper prices because I just, we got to fight back at this point. We just gotta be patient because I heard like a reprint is coming uh, in the near future. I think two reprints of this, but I also heard that there's not going to be a reprint of Cosmic Eclipse or Vivid Voltage uh, ETBs, which kind of makes me sad. Did I do the card trick? I don't know. Did I? I did. Psychic Energy. I got off my train of thought. So no guess there. Uh, Turfield, Los Lumbres, Scyther, Fullaby, Derpy. <laughs> I got plenty of Derpies. Magmar. Galarian Yamask. Yamask, kid. A nice reverse hollow. Natu, how do you do? And a non holographic Probo Pass. So, three non hollows there. That's not a good way to start. Let's see if Toxtricity here. The Toxtricity of our city. Of our city. I can't really sing, but there's some, some poorly sang system of a down for you, for you there. Yeah, I don't know. It's just and then battle styles. Uh, don't get me started with that. I had some Amazon pre-orders because they had another green code card. We're just like in a funk right now, man. Um, don't get me started with Amazon. I mean, I got some. Uh, I think Amazon had a good deal with two uh, ETBs. I think I got my ETBs through there. Um, for battle styles, like one of each. And I know I got some like a. Uh, some three pack blisters from them. I think that's it. Uh, those those say they're coming as of now, but like I'm kind of expecting some shining fates nonsense, and like I don't know if they'll come or not. Cause like I had the Mad Pin Collection party, whatever they're called, from Amazon, and those they basically sent you an email like, oh, we don't know when they're coming, but do you still want them? And I was like, well, yes. <laughs> so we'll see what happens with that. Uh, fire. But yeah, then I got my other pre-orders for Battle Styles, I think, on Game Nerds. Because I've I've got a few things. I got, like, the, the Meowth uh, V-Box from them and a few other things. And they came pretty pretty promptly. Oh, here's Dan. 
Reverse Hollow Dan. And a nine to a majestic looking nine tail. That is a pretty cool art there. A uh, non hollow, of course. See, I'm worried that my uh, battle styles from Game Nerds is just not going to happen or it's going to be delayed. But, like, I've also I got such a good price. It was like 90 bucks, I think. $89.99. It was such a good pre order. Just like that's why I was I jumped on that. I wish I got more from Safari Zone, though, because they're usually pretty good. Not that Game Nerds isn't bad, but it's just like, I don't know if it's Shining Fates or them. I'm assuming it's Shining Fates. I just hope Battle Styles is a little better for everyone. At least if you pre-ordered, you know? Another green code card, five in a row. This is this has been a pretty rough booster box for me. Pretty rough. Uh, electric. Grass. I should be guessing grass, because most of them are in grass. A Palo Sand, Training Court, Medite, Stunks, Grubs, Wing, Natu, Aracuda, a blue Aracuda, Reverse Hollow, and a Snorlax. I like Snorlax, that's pretty cool. I don't think I have this card, so we'll take it for now. Yeah, how about a white code card, though? Like, uh, some little luck here. So, yeah, I don't know, it's... Going back on the battle style, Shining Fates, I, I'm hoping, I'm hoping the pre-orders will come through, um, I saw some other website I never ordered from, it was like called like Dragonfly Games or something like that, a white code card, finally, um, they were pre-ordering for like 120 and then there was like a local game store near me, I'm in New Hampshire, um, I don't remember their name. But I was on like a, a wait a wait list, not a pre order list. So like I don't I haven't heard anything from them. But I could pick that up in person. I think their price was like under a hundred for the booster box of uh I was gonna say a Rebel Clash of a uh, battle style. So maybe that's a backup plan. We'll see. Uh, fire. I just keep guessing like all wrong. Capture energy. See, I mean, hopefully it gets better. I mean, supposedly production is going to be ramping up, so hopefully they can beat out this the uh, scalpers. I don't know. It's just it's not getting fun. Okay, so we have a good pull here. We have a reverse hollow uncommon Pelipper and a another. This is my second full art Eldegoss V. That's a nice pull. So I got two of these, so that's can't really complain. Let's open up. Be loud, noisy. Let's open up the sleeve. Let's sleeve this puppy. It's looking pretty, pretty good. We will throw you there behind the uh, Guardians Rising. I would say Guardians of the Galaxy set. So we have about 12, 12 left of part one. Still not halfway there. So yeah, um... Even like some, a lot of my like booster boxes, a lot of my back catalog stock, whatever, if you want to call it, that like I, I purchased like it was end of 2020 or like early on in uh, 2021. Like lately, I feel like I haven't really made many uh, purchases of new, another white coat card of like new stuff. I've been into... If you follow my Instagram, Chris Collects Things, on Instagram, you'll see me. My profile pictures of Char, the same Charizard as YouTube, if anybody actually follows me. Uh, I'm going to guess Water Energy. Um, yeah, I've been into, like, I go on eBay, and I've been getting, uh, let's see if we get another sweet pull here. I've been getting uh, pack fresh open packs, because, like, sealed stuff has been so expensive. So if you can get, like pack fresh open there's usually no hollows in it obviously so that's a disadvantage you just kind of look on like tcg player and like see like value wise i mean you're you are overpaying here's a, a reverse hollow here's a 0.5 for those keeping score at home dragapult rare and a toxtricity v very nice was that from a toxtricity pack no it was from a ryla pack that would have been very appropriate so here's another good pull for us another two good pulls i'll take so yeah, I've been looking up buying, looking into pack fresh cards. It's like I've gotten a lot of like Neo sets, uh, Discovery Genesis, um, Revelation. I forget the other one. We'll even sleep Dragapult here because he's a, a reverse hollow rare. 
Uh, what's the other set? I forget. I always get them confused anyways. Yes, I've got, I've got a lot of those, like some, some pretty decent cards, even if there's none hollows. Um, I've actually got some base set stuff, which I don't know if I've posted any at this point. But I actually got a first edition, two first edition base set packs in German. Um, I know what the star was a Beedrill, and I think like a scoop up or something. But I got got some pretty good cards. It was first edition, like pack fresh. Like that's just nice to have, especially like the artwork. So I obviously didn't save my uh, base set pack art artwork from uh, another white code card. So we get a little a white streak going here instead of green. Yeah, I obviously didn't see my base set packs from when I was a kid because I didn't have the foresight for that. And uh, in 2015, when I was collecting again, I'm going to guess grass. I didn't. Here's another Dan. I didn't get any base set packs. I think I tried to get either a Japanese or like a Spanish one on eBay because I was looking through like old emails. So I save all my emails uh, and folders on like my old Yahoo account. Derpy, Galarian Corsola, Reverse Hollow, and a Galarian Corsola, Regular Hollow. I think I have a Reverse Hollow of this, not this one though. So we will take it. Um, where was I going with that? Yeah, and I, I, I saw that there was an eBay sale for the a base set Spanish pack that I tried to do and then the seller canceled on me. <laughs> it's like womp womp. They either sold it or they got cold feet. I don't know. I sold it to someone else. Uh, I don't know. It's a little sketchy. Whatever. I guess that was unfortunate. But I did get a bunch of like jungle packs, rocket, Japanese and English, some Japanese fossil. I think I even got some gym. The first gym set of uh, Japanese. I forget what it's called in Japan. Another white code card. So we've got a white, the white streak commences. I'm going to guess fire again because I guess I really like fire today. Pyromaniac here. Pelipper, Pillow Sand, Helioptile, Honage, Litwick, Professor Litwick. Isn't he a Harry Potter professor? <laughs> Galarian Cursola. It just looks so like dry and dead. A Binacle. He heats more reverse hollow rare, nice. And okay, another V card, a nine tails of V. Very, very nice. Very nice. Another good pull here. We have about four and a half pulls. About halfway through the half lot. Halfway through the half, if that makes any sense. Um, so let's go with the robot reboot. That's not the, I said, like I said, sword and shield. I've actually been like, I've been playing through it. Um, I've actually been at a pause the past couple of weeks because like my child hasn't been sleeping good. So usually I play after he goes to bed, but lately I'm just too exhausted. I just can't <laughs> put him to sleep and then I just go to bed basically. <laughs> Zone out to some TV. I need, to, I need some more time, uh. Green code card. The streak is ended. Combo breaker. One, two, three, four. See, so yeah, I know. Excuses, excuses. Water. Should I guess fire there? Masquerade. So yeah, I, I should have. Uh, I should. I gotta make time to keep playing it because I've been enjoying it. It's. I. It's probably the last one I've enjoyed since. Uh, plat. I played platinum. It's so, like I. I tried playing sun and moon and. Uh, X and Y, and they just really didn't do much for me. I don't know, like Sun and Moon with like the different gems. Here's a Garbodor non hollow. Sun and Moon with like the non gem. It was like interesting because it was different, but then I just feel like I just kind of up. Man, I just kind of gave up, which is unfortunate. I have to like commit. I still want to go back and like finish or I'll probably just start over. I feel like I get with like the Pokemon games is like you get like halfway through. If you don't really like it, you just kind of stop. And then, like, you just want to start over from scratch. You don't remember where you are. And then you're just kind of like, oh, I remember why I quit in the first place of this one. I probably shouldn't do that. I also have, like, uh, I forget if I have black or white, too. Which is, like, worth a pretty penny nowadays. Glad I got it when I did. White code cards. So we get something good here, hopefully. Uh, yeah, I wish I... Uh, 
I feel like I, I feel like I've been really out of focus today. I don't know why. My camera. What was I saying? Black and white too is is a pretty penny now. Yeah. Um. Water. I feel like I lost my train of thought there. Um. I actually tried uh my to start a new train of thought. My wife like was doing like a product review, so she got some stuff like to review. And uh, I think she was like, she got like these like brain pills. I don't remember the brand or whatever. I'm not gonna really. Reverse Hatna and a Dragapult holographic. So to go with our reverse holo, we have the holo version now. Very nice. So these like brain pills, I was like, oh, can you take them? And then like, tell me how it is. Like I've been taking them for like a week now and I feel like I've made no progress. I don't feel any smarter, any more focused. I'm just like my normal, like scattered, <laughs> scatterbrain, like whatever self. So I was like, I don't think they're working. <laughs> it's like, yeah, it shows. You're not remembering things. Like, yeah, clearly. As I'm just thinking, I was like, oh crap, I forgot to do this. <laughs> After this video, I gotta go do that because I have. I have a piece of equipment that somebody's gonna come look at and I haven't charged it. Here's another white card. So I probably should do that. It's like between like work and then just like everything. It's just, I don't know. Normal people multitask better than me. That's all I'm gonna say. Uh, water. Nice, got one. Ooh, Woolly World Metapod, that's a cool one. Heliolisk, we got another good, uh, it's a Burning Scarf, Growlit, Derpy. Another good heavy hitter here, I think. Binacle, Galarian Darumaka, a Heliolisk Reverse Hollow, and a nice Dragapult V Max. I think this is a full art. It doesn't have the silver border though. Let's go to the let's go to the website that I have pulled up over here. Dragapult V Max number ninety three. So I don't think it is a full art. It's just the VMAX version. Yeah, because it's 93. It would be like a higher number. Where are you, dude? Dragapult VMAX, 93. Yeah. Still a sweet, still a very, very, very sweet pull. Just can't complain about that. I like the textures on these and whatnot. We've had some pretty good, we had like a, we started off slow and then like I feel like we've had some pretty good pulls. So can't complain about that. Int Inteleon or something? I think that's Inteleon. Inteleon. I didn't pick him. I picked Gr I picked Gurky. Gurky gang. Hashtag Gurky gang. So I feel like I don't really know the other starters as well. And as I was saying, and I keep bouncing back and forth, I have to finish Sun and Moon. I think I've only threw like three gems. Sun and Moon. Sword and Shield. I do have to finish Sun and Moon, though. That is correct. Another uh, green. Uh, we just had white, so green. That's unfortunate. Uh, I'm going to go grass because I feel like I haven't said it, and it's happened a lot. Darkness. Dan. I don't know who Dan is. I have a friend named Dan. It's just like a very <laughs> weird trainer name. Derpy. Milo and Otis. And a... A barbarical, a bar, a barbacle, bar, 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 if you think about it, like I've heard somebody, somebody who has kids, like who we talked to, they said like their kids were terrified from it. And I was like, I see why. She's literally like an organ thief. She wants to steal his voice box. <laughs> it's like it's very creepy. Uh, if when you think about it, I'm gonna get steel grass. I almost said grass too because whatever, because <laughs> I've been getting grass a lot. Um, so yeah, it's a very, very creepy scene when you think about it. So it's like, yeah, I didn't like the music or whatever. It's like, they did some, some heavy stuff there. Uh, a reverse hollow nugget in a apple ton holographic. It's a very colorful and vibrant holographic, so I will give it that. There's another one pull. Just throw all the, uh, throw it up. We got, so the last four of this 
video. And then the next video, we'll see how we do there. As I'm getting notifications from the Twitter I follow about Pokemon notifications, uh, this week has just been a, uh, a you know what storm of like, oh, go here, Best Buy, like Target, and like I've got I've gotten a whole lot of nothing. I my wallet's probably happy about that, <laughs> but my Pokemon heart is not. It's very sad because I can't get anything, can't find anything, nothing. Uh, grass. Let's just keep going. Get on the grass bandwagon. So this is white, so we should have something good here. Electrode. Electrode. Uh, one of my buddies watched game essays. He did a video of evolutions, uh, the worst evolutions in Pokemon. So here's a reverse all star. Here's a Galarian Pezik. Oh, and we got a gold card. A gold. So we got reverse Galarian Perserker. And then we got a, a gold. I want the gold. I like gold. Gold member. Check out A Cast of the Pass. Uh, future review of gold member on their channel, by the way. I'm, <laughs> I am a uh, 0.5 member of them. Uh, so you can actually check me out on... A cast of the Past on YouTube or uh, your podcast app. I know they're on the Apple Podcast. This is a great pull. We got a gold pull. I really can't complain, man. Pretty good pulls in this box. I figures like the crappy sets are what I pulled the best from, but hey, whatever. Um, what was I saying? A cast to the past. Um... Um, yeah, so you can check me out on their latest video, um, uh, sorry, I'm losing train of thought here, so third pack to go, um, yeah, you can check me out on the cast of the past, I'm really sorry, I'm like, I'm, I'm losing my focus for a second. Uh, I feel like I always try to film and then people are always bothering me. Like, people are always texting me or something. And I'm just like, okay, can I just have some, like, peace and quiet here? <laughs> just for, like, a 20, 30 minutes. Uh, fire energy. Yeah. Um, sorry. Check me out on the cast of the past. Uh, Pokemon TCG Game Boy game. Game Boy Color game uh, video. I was That was my first one. That was a lot of fun. Here's a nice reverse hollow rare scissor. In a spirit tom non hollow. Um, so it's like a 0.5 pull. Um, yeah, and so I, I plan to be in more in the future. Uh, I don't know how, how many, but they they know I'm interested. I had a good time with that, that podcasting. So, um, and then also you can check out game essays. He did it, uh, top. I don't know if it was top five or evolutions in Pokemon that don't make any sense. Like the Remoraid, uh, he mentions that in the Gold and Silver leak. Uh, Remoraid was actually a gun, so like the evolution made more sense. But like they didn't want kids dealing with guns, so yeah, there's that. And then Electro is just kind of lame. It's like, yeah, I got kind of agree. But, but the, the shiny is nice. That's green. Usually I second, to, I didn't say second to last pack magic. Um, of this video, otherwise it would have went better. Water, fire, horror energy, heat more. Um, yeah, with Caterpie, I'm just gonna kind of go quick here, a little quick. Uh, Mill Cree Reverse Hall in a Galarian Mr. Rhyme, which I have. So, last pack magic for this video because we're at about a half an hour here, but we've had some fire pulls like this gold Galarian Berserker, a V Max, a couple V's. Can't complain. That's probably the Galarian Preserker. I doubt I'm going to get another fire pull from this. I think it's going to be like a one, one, one a box thing. One a box. Uh, so we're going to end on a low note, unfortunately. Uh, water. Skyla. I do have that. I think that full Skyla. Is that what I said? Rainbow Rare, Galarian Meowth, Caterpie, Luxie, oh, Reverse Hollow, Andy, Agus Slash, Non-Hollow, which I don't think I have, so that's a good hit. 
Anyways, guys, uh, part two will be coming up shortly. Um, I'll try to release them in the same week at least. I'm very bad at releasing videos sometimes. Uh, so anyways, like, subscribe, and comment, and we'll see the second half of this booster box. And let's see if we can continue the fire pulls. Uh, peace.